On the In Focus section, Austin is now going to demonstrate how we uninstall Samsung TalkBack from Samsung phones running Android 11. Uh, many people have been experiencing issues with this in terms of responsiveness and in terms of a lack of functionality in some apps. Hello, everyone. This is the demo on how to uninstall Samsung's infamous TalkBack that they bought with Android 11. And a lot of people okay, were facing a lot of items. issues with that. It was very less responsive and all those things. So I decided to make a demo to uninstall that and install Google Talkback. So you will need you will need ADB and Fastboot, which I'll be linking in the show notes. And you will be needing some commands and you'll be needing two packages. One is Google Talkback and one is commentary. You can download Google Talkback from APK Mirror and commentary I will be linking in the show notes. So let's get started. This is the Galaxy Note 10 Plus with One UI 3.1. So let's first we need to enable we need to enable the ADB services navigate and Software update, download tips and user maps, accessibility, we need general to go management to... apps, default battery and digital well-being apps, tips about phone, Stat about phone, about phone, navigate up, but about search, Alice, edit, RZ 300, 359, status information, legal information, regulatory software, software information, 7 of 10. And go to software Double. information. Software, soft, one UI, Android version, one UI version, 3.1, one of 12, Android version, Google Play, basement version, kernel version, build number, RP1, 200,720 point. You have to click on this seven times. Double developer tap. mode, developer mode has already been turned on. Okay, very good. We have enabled developer mode. So what you need to do is just uh, click seven times and you'll get developer mode enabled. It'll ask you for your PIN or password or pattern or whatever you have set. So now you need to go back. Developer options. Find developer options. Developer OEM unlock running service. Web view auto demo mode. Quick debug. USB debugging. Debug mode when USB is connected. Off switch 14. This is of off, one. so turn it on. Allow USB. Cancel. Okay. And okay. Developer options. USB debugging. Debug mode when USB is connected. On switch. Now it will one say one USB one device one is one connected, one but one now one there one is another, um, another procedure that you need to do on your computer. So let's start it. You can do this without installing commentary, but uh, if you have cited help around, you can do this without installing commentary. But I don't have um, cited help around, so I will install commentary also. But then you can uninstall it. Once you install TalkBack, you can remove commentary. Uh, once you install and start TalkBack, you can uninstall commentary. So let's start. Okay, so I'll open Yesterday, this platform tools, one. platform tools. Platform tools, I don't... Now, on a mailing list, I had written a guide. Many people had problems regarding it. So let me clarify. What you need to do is you need to go to the address bar that is Alt D. Address combo box collapsed. Edit D selected C. Users D combo And erase everything from here. And open CMD by typing CMD. You can also open PowerShell, but PowerShell. The commands are hard. They they are difficult, but there is a way to simplify them. If you want to do it the PowerShell way, I will be linking um, an article that describes you how to uh, set ADB and Fastboot as environment parts on Windows. So let's open CMD. CMD C, Windows System 32 CMD dot X Terminal C Users Us Downloads Platform Tools Greater Microsoft. Now let's type ADB devices. A D B space D E V I C E S S. I type double S, so I just erase one. Let's see what happens. Start demon not running. Starting now at TCP colon 5037. Okay. Start demon started successfully. List of devices okay. attached. Stop RZM 744 YKZR unauthorized. So it said the device is unauthorized. So we need to. The computer's not checked. Check. Check, check this box to always check. allow. Check box. Always and allow from this computer. Cancel. Allow button. Allow. 
And in this way, we have now started uh, the communication between the computer and the device. So let's start getting our packages installed. First, we need to install commentary. Now, when you download the packages, I would highly recommend that you rename the files to something very easy to install. Like commentary should be renamed as com. Talkback should be renamed as uh, the long. It has a long name. So you should rename it to TB or Talkback or whatever you want to rename it to so that it's easy to type. So let's uh, do this. Let's type ADB install. I-N-S-T-A-L-L space C-O-M. I'm calling mine as commentary uh, C-O-M. So I'll type C-O-M dot A-P-K. You can type whatever you have named the package to. And performing streamed install. Success. See users of the downloads platform tools greater. Okay. So it's saying success. So let's turn on commentary. Now you can get the names of packages and the app is called package info view. And then you can uninstall all the apps that you want to uninstall using the uh, the same command. Just replace com.samsung.accessibility with the com name of the package and you can uninstall it. Now, warning, there are some critical apps that you may uninstall. Do not uninstall those. Otherwise, you may land up in, in a problem. And the only way, there are two ways actually of getting out of the problem. One is uh, if you can download the ROM for your phone, stock ROM, extract it and see if you can find the APK and install it. Otherwise, second, the only way to come out of this problem is to format your phone because once you format your phone, your uh, apps will be like how it was before. It's, It's just temporarily uninstalling it. It's not, it's like permanently uninstalled, but it's only for that user. Now, the next step is uninstalling Samsung Talkback. And to do this, you need to... You need to first open ADB Shell. So let's type it. ADB space S-A-E-L-L. D2 slash dollar. It's in D2S slash dollar. That's the device name, short code name. So you need to type this long command that you need to use because in adb shell once you're in adb shell you cannot paste the command so that is the problem with adb shell so let me just show you the command so i'll type the command first then i'll read it out to you so the command is pm space uninstall space dash k space and then there are two dash signs user space zero space so this is the long command i'll be link i'll be putting it in the show notes so let me just press enter and it has said success so bye bye Samsung talk back. Now we need to install Google talk back. So to do this, you need to type exit first. So E-X-I-T. Now you need to type ADB install. Now I'm calling my talk back, Google talk back as talkback.apk. So so and press enter and success so talkback has been installed and now let's start talkback so we have installed google talkback and to prove it to you let me show you the screen of the new talkback this is 9.1 or something Next button, you will get simpler menus, voice control, and more. You will learn about key updates and changes in the next few screens. This will take about three minutes. And next, close button. I'm just going to close Double this tap. because close tutorial. we have already you done this. Back. Stay in tutorial. Close button. Close. Talk back. Navigate up. Talk, talk back. Talk back. Short. Not checked. Talk back. Shortcut. 
Allow view use view use deny allow use ex got it got it and talk back. another thing Set when talk settings talk. sound and vibe speak verbosity text just audio Have new feature talk backs navigate talk back settings new on text verb speak sub control custom up custom up braille key braille keyboard and Double here you have this activate. braille keyboard that you did not have in Samsung Talkback. And this Talkback, the latest version available as of March the 6th, 2021. The version can change. I downloaded it from APK Mirror and I'll be linking the page of APK Mirror from on, in the show notes. So the show notes will have the command. It will have the links to and APK Mirror's Talkback.